Shocking revelation, Jermal Charlo's hidden emotions exposed in face-to-face -face encounter with Canelo Alvarez. Amidst the criticism surrounding Canelo Alvarez's unanimous decision victory on Saturday in Las Vegas, Marco Barrera, who was present throughout the weekend, expressed his disappointment with the American fighter's performance. I was there in Las Vegas the whole time, observing Charlo's behavior, watching how he moved around the hotel, everywhere, and he had a look of panic, Barrera revealed on Probox TV. When you're preparing for an important fight, you have that spark in your eyes, that I'm here to surprise, to give my best, but he didn't have it. Throughout the fight, Canelo was never truly challenged, but according to the former world champion, the blame lies not with the Mexican fighter, but with a terrified opponent. Perhaps the least to blame was Canelo, the only one who stepped into the ring that night, Barrera added. Charlo was nowhere to be found that night, running, scared, afraid. He had sheer terror of standing in that ring. Charlo, a marathon runner, not a lion. Despite proclaiming himself to be a lion during the final press conference, Charlo turned out to be more of a marathon runner who evaded confrontation all night, remarked Marco. I believe Charlo knew it from the way in, he used a couple of words and left. His face, his attitude didn't resemble that of a fighter who wanted to shine, he commented. He said he would be a lion, but I think he turned out to be a marathon runner instead. The mistake was on his part, maybe he didn't really want the fight and only took it for the paycheck. I think he was absent that night. Thus, while Charlo entered the ring with the goal of avoiding a knockout, there was only one true contender in the T-Mobile arena that night, and that was Canelo, even though he couldn't secure a knockout victory. He came out not to be knocked out, he came out to run. At no point did he make Canelo Alvarez work, Barrera concluded. We must remember that for a great fight, there need to be two boxers, and that night there was only one, Canelo, moving forward, throwing powerful punches. But what happened? Even with the weight advantage, he couldn't deliver a devastating blow to Charlo. So, in my opinion, Charlo has a lot left to prove. Question of the day, do you believe Jermal Charlo genuinely showed fear in front of Saul, Canelo, Alvarez, or was it simply a defensive strategy? Leave your opinion in the comments and join the discussion. If you enjoy content related to the world of boxing, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and enable notifications to stay up to date with our future videos. Join our community of boxing enthusiasts and stay informed about the latest news and analysis in this thrilling sport. Thank you for being part of our audience, and we look forward to your participation in the comments. See you in the next video.